Edward was resting in the side inn. He was just going to nod off to sleep when he heard a familiar whistle. Puffing round the corner was an engine he recognised. Richard, he said. How wonderful to see you, he said. Last time I saw you, you were at the, you were at the scrapyard, he said. That's right, Edward. And you were right, he said. Well, one day one of us will be put into a museum and have a look around or be back at service puffing cheerfully round. And I'm here to help on your branch line. That's good, said Edward. But take my tip. Watch out for Bill and Ben. They're sure to play tricks. Don't worry, I know what to do. When Bill and Ben found out there was a new engine, they were excited to play tricks. But they found playing tricks on Richard was a mistake. Richard's first job was taking a load of china clay down to, the, to Edward's station. The trucks found he was very strong, and they didn't dare play with trucks on him. Soon, he arrived at the end of the line. He went in the siding and had a rest. Just then, Stepney arrived with some old vans. Sorry, said the station master. Ed Emily has just gone up the hill with, with another engine. You'll have to wait for him. Oh dear, said Edward. I'm going to be late. Beep, beep. Sha shan't be long, shouted, said Richard. The station master was puzzled about Ri Richard taking the train. The worst trucks on the whole railway were old vans. They pay no attention to anyone. Not even to engines, diesels, coaches and even other trucks. They decided to take a dislike to Richard. When, when they were puffing up the hill, they shouted, Hold back! Hold back! They giggled. Richard heard that. Oh no you don't! Get a move on! He bellowed loudly as he forced them up the hill. Ooh, uh, they said. Wish we never thought of this, they said. Richard was charging hard, and soon disaster struck. No one was hurt. Soon work workmen arrived to help to clean the mess leaving Richard words of nothing. That night, the fat controller came to see him. Well, Richard, I think I haven't still found my banker yet, he said. Richard agreed. I also found you quite strong, Richard, he said. So, I was wondering, do you think banking duties is good for you? No, sir, said Richard. I think I'd rather stick with China clay trains. I understand, said the fat controller. He tipped his hat and walked away. After that, Richard left alone in the shed, all silent. He didn't say anything after that.